keep we keep moving forward. Um, you know, again, I, I felt like we uh, we did a nice job in some areas. I, I thought, uh, you know, for uh, what we're trying to do, uh, you know, in terms of fundamentals and techniques and and the uh, the growth and building of a football team, I think we're uh, we're we're making good progress. Um, I thought uh, the guys again came out with a good attitude, worked hard. Uh, we had some some sunshine out there today, uh, coming over the the stands there bright and early in the morning, which is always a good thing, and I think that led to a, a pretty productive day. Sure. Uh, anybody uh, really impressed you today? Either maybe a, a certain a certain group, maybe the secondary or defensive line or anything like well, that. Well, I thought overall, I think I, I feel like our defense continues to make great progress. I did see a, a couple of. Uh, uh, what people like to call pick sixes. We had an interception return in, uh, in the thud section of a uh, uh, first down drill, uh, Vince Owen Gibbons, and then we had another one later on in our team third down drill, uh, Trevor Costin. So I think two of those big play type of things stood out. Uh, it's nice to see the defense be able to, um, you know, those coast, in those cases, in situations, to be able to, to make a play and to do something with the ball and the transition. That's a big part of the game nowadays is uh, you're not only getting the takeaway, but doing something with it in terms of field position or possible score. Uh, you know, on the other hand, it's not good to see the offense turn the ball over. So mm-hmm. uh, that's kind of the challenge you face every spring. You know, when, when one side's doing well, it's probably at the uh, misfortune of the other side. And uh, But I know there'll be some offensive plays that they'll be making that we'll be uh, concerned about our defense. It just kind of works that way as you go through the spring. Uh, obviously, uh, you mentioned Vince Owen Givens and Trevor Costin. They both had very nice years last year. Um, and you figure that they'll play a big part in our success next season, Coach? Well, I, I think uh, obviously you raise your expectations when younger mm-hmm. players, both sophomores last year, um, stand up and uh, uh, earn starting positions and then perform at a high level. And, and, and you see that progress during the year where they go from, you know, the initial starter to a more veteran player. Um, I think that really uh, speaks volumes about progress and improvement. Um, And you can see uh, now that they've gone through an off-season, you know, strength and conditioning program, you can see a a level of confidence uh, in them that they, you know, naturally uh, embrace because of their time on the field last year, the game slows down a little bit for them. The, uh, the, uh, the alignments, the assignments, the, uh, the checks, the balances, and those kind of things uh, aren't, aren't as uh, intimidating to them now. They're, they're really more veteran, and, and we hope that with all of the young players that we used last year to gain experience, we, we hope to see uh, that in all of those guys.